Yo, what's going on guys, we're on HD here, today I'm bringing you guys a double swarm gameplay with the PDW with the suppressor, the stock, the uh, ghost fight check and toughness and dexterity with the Kimbo B23R. So I'm going to just add that little clip in at the start. Uh, I got two kills there obviously with the B23R, then I you know, got two more kills and died. And I got another couple of kills and I died again, but uh, from here on this point in the video I don't die anymore. I go on a 40 plus kill streak, I get two swarms in one life, I absolutely go to town on these guys. And um, yeah, I just cut out like the last bit of uh, this round, the first bit of the next round, you know, just, uh, just you know, me running around, you know, nothing interesting, but um, uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to uh, bring, uh, bringing you guys a gameplay with the Diamond Peacekeeper. And look at the range on those Kimbos, man, that's absolutely amazing. Gotta say, they're really OP though, I kind of really hate getting killed by them, but anyways. And um, all I need now is the, I think I need the gold camera on the Scorpion, I need like 30 more, 30 or 40 more headshots and I got challenges. And then I'll have the diamond guns, and of course that means the diamond peacekeeper. And I uh, really want to try and get you guys a double swarm, and you know, maybe if I can do a, like a live commentary double swarm, one of the new maps, that'd be really, really cool. Uh, but yeah, if I just get a swarm, uh, doing a live comment, I'd be happy with that. So hopefully I'll bring you guys maybe early next week, hopefully. And uh, but I really want to try and get gameplays on the new maps, I know you guys want to see those as well, but um, I can't download the new maps, uh, you know, I'm kind of used to this back from Black Ops 1, like maybe uh, some, maybe next week it'll work, just sometimes I'll s turn on my Xbox and I'll start downloading it and uh, it'll just go and it'll be like 100% in like 5 minutes, it's just absolutely miraculous, I don't know. And then uh, right now it just stops on 23 or 24% and it just doesn't move. I left, I've left it on overnight, I've left it on, you know, like, just throughout the day, you know, kind of, like, I've tried everything, like, literally, restarting my router, like, you know, disconnected my Xbox from Xbox Live, tested the connection, this and that, and I don't know, like, uh, if there's any kind of hacks that you guys know, then, <laughs> you know what I mean, not hacks, but, uh, if there's anything that you guys know that could kind of increase my chances of, like, downloading it, <laughs> then I'd be really, really excited to know, but, uh, but yeah, I'm pretty sure there's nothing I can do besides, you know, just uh, keep trying, and I hope to get lucky one day. Uh, but yeah, someday the day will come. <laughs> Anyways, and uh, if you guys haven't already subscribed, uh, please hit that subscribe button, you know, stay up to date. And uh, believe it or not, guys, uh, you guys know I'm not the biggest zombie player, but uh, the other day I got up to, I think I got up to like around 17 or something, uh, playing Nuketown Zombies. And uh, Nuketown Zombies is actually so much fun. I gotta admit, it is really, really hard. Uh, to start off, like, first time I played it, I'm not joking, I only got up to round 4, and that was really, really weird, but, um, I will be doing, uh, maybe even today, or if not today, then early next week, uh, everything you need to know about, um, Black Ops 2 Nuketown Zombies, uh, you know, basically all the beginner tips and tricks that I had to find out by myself, uh, when I was learning, and, um, the reason why I was playing Zombies was, uh, you know, we had to turn off the power for a little bit, and, um, uh, that's right, not the power, we had to turn off the internet for a little bit, and, uh, and I was just like, wow, I'm offline, what am I going to do? So I decided to play some zombies, and I started playing, I think I played it for like four hours straight, it was actually lots of fun. I'm going to try and, you know, get back into zombies, I used to play a lot more zombies Black and Black Ops 1 days, uh, but I kind of got out of it, I don't know, like, Black Ops 2 zombies is lots of fun, don't get me wrong, but I don't know, I just kind of found multiplayer just that little bit uh, more attractive for me, I guess. Um, anyways, but, um, I'm not really going to talk forever in this video, uh, just about the gameplay, uh, but I kind of wanted to talk about uh, just a couple of little things which uh, people don't really normally do commentaries about. I just want to talk a little bit about uh, some interesting life experiences or uh, things that have happened to me that, you know, you know, maybe you guys might want to know. I don't know, sometimes I get really bored with my life and I just kind of want to, you know, hear about what other people do and stuff like that. So I don't know, maybe you guys are in the same boat, I don't know, but um... Yeah, this one time I was driving back, like we just came back from the... We were in the country for like two weeks and we just went on a little holiday. And uh, I was driving on the freeway and um... I was just about to say in my ride, but it's my mum's ride, but I drive it, but anyway. <laughs> and uh, there was a guy, like, he had a mattress strapped on top of his car, and um, we're just, like, driving past, like, he's in the left lane, we're kind of, like, they're four lanes, and, like, you know, we're in the second one from him, like, basically right next to him, and his mattress just, like, falls right off the car, and uh, just blocks, like, an entire lane, just car, you just hear, like, kind of cars, like, you know, just, in, like, you know, in the background, just like, Oh, it was really intense, man. I thought someone was going to die, but I don't think anyone did. And, um, yeah, if you guys are, like, you know, going to carry around, like, mattresses on your car, make sure you strap them down properly. And uh, also, if you guys ever come down to Australia, or maybe you guys live here, and you guys, uh, I'm assuming that you guys have been to, like, all the routes, like, the most whack place, like, no one goes to. Um, but unless you're, like, Chinese or something. And, um, if you guys go there, make sure you, like, stay away from, like, the Aboriginal settlements. I don't want, like says you're not meant to go there, but like we just went in, the, we just went there because we're like we're that hardcore, and because um, we like don't give a fuck, man. 
And uh, those Aboriginals will eat you, man. I mean, like, no offense if you're Aboriginal, but uh, there's some really scary Aboriginals out there, guys. Like, watch your backs, man. And, um, yeah, where, oh, look at this swarm final kill count. That was the end of the gameplay. That was so quick. I didn't really get through everything, but uh, stay up to date, guys. I'll be bringing you guys the best classes, videos, zombies, gameplay, and much more. Remember to like the video. Peace out, guys. See you really, really soon. Bye.